Hello, once again. You're welcome to our educational channel. Today we have a steel rod of a diameter 20 mm of original length 300 mm subjected to 30 kN tensile force. Once again, we have a steel rod of a diameter 20 mm and of original length 300 mm subjected to 30 kN tensile force. Now, we are asked to calculate three entities. First, calculate the applied tensile stress on the steel rod. Two, calculate the lateral strain given that the tensile strain of it on the steel rod is 0 0.00655. Three, calculate the final rod thickness. Now we have very good important parameters being given. Yeah? Now in order to find the applied tensile stress, which is number one, we use the formula given to us, knowing fully well that we have the Poisson ratio of a steel, which is 0 0.3, and we know that Poisson ratio is lateral strain over tensile strain, which equals minus EV over EM. So this is lateral strain, this is tensile strain. Now we have our original diameter, 20 mm. We have our original length of the steel, 300 mm. We have the tensile force subjected, which is 30 kN. Now, in order to find our applied tensile stress, we use the stress formula, which is sigma equals force over area. Once again, sigma, which is stress, equals force over area. So stress equals force over area. In order to find the cross-sectional area of the steel rod given, we use the formula, which is pi d squared over 4, pi d squared over 4. Now, our cross-sectional area equals 3.14 multiplied by 20 squared, which is our diameter, original diameter, over 4. We give us 314 millimeters squared which is our steel rod cross-sectional area. This is our steel rod cross-sectional area. So now we're slotting in into the stress formula, which is sigma equals F over A, which gives us 30 times 10 to the power 3 over 314, which gives us 95.54 megapascal. So our stress calculated equals 95.54 megapascal. Now, let's go back to um, our second question, which is calculate this tensile strain given. Calculate the tensile strain given that the tensile strain equals 0 0.005655. Now, we have our Poisson ratio which is equals the negative lateral strain over tensile strain. From there, we can find our lateral strain, which we are asked to find, which equals the product of the Poisson ratio of the steel rod, which is 0 0.3, multiplied by the, our tensile strain, find 3 times 0 0.00655, which gives us negative 0 0.001965. Which give us the calculated lateral strain of our steel rod. Now we are asked to find the final steel rod thickness. We are asked to find the final steel rod thickness. How do we find that? By using the formula lateral strain equals the change in diameter over the original diameter of the steel rod. So for us to find that we bring down our change in diameter which equals lateral, the product of lateral strain to original diameter. We give us 
change in diameter equals negative 0 0.009565 times 20 which gives us negative 0 0.0393 millimeter now to find our final steel rod then we subtract the change in diameter from the original length which gives us the final diameter equals 20 minus 0 0.00393 millimeters so which give us 19.9961 millimeter don't let forget that we have four decimal places here in order for us to find the accuracy so we have 19.9961 millimeter thank you